Hello everybody, what is up? Welcome back to another vlog on the channel. Today is Sunday, it's Father's Day, and my dad's actually been working all afternoon, and he just got off, so I'm gonna go head over to his house. Um, I just thought it'd be fun to do a little days in my life vlog today, tomorrow, a little bit of Tuesday. I was out of town last week, I was in Illinois for a family reunion. Oh, I love going there. It's my favorite place in the world. I've been going there since I was literally in my mother's womb. It's just such a special place to me. And my boyfriend came too, so it was really cool to show him where I go every summer and, and have him meet a lot of my family. So that was really, really fun. And it was really good for the soul, but I didn't vlog. So I wanna get back on my vlogging grind. So I thought it'd be fun to vlog tonight. It's Father's Day. We're going to a nice dinner later. Me, my dad, and my brother sleeping at my dad's house. And tomorrow, lots to do, kind of a gal on the go type of day. So it's gonna be fun next few days. Thought I'd vlog. And I really like my outfit right now, so I thought I'd show you guys. So here is my little outfit of the night. This dress is beautiful. It's this light green dress. I love midi dresses right now. They're just so fun. This is from ASOS. I will link it down below. I recently got it, so they should still have it on the website. I just love it, it's so fun. Necklaces, I've got a whole little stack going on right now. Um, this one right here is a set, so these two together. And these two are from Argento Vivo, it comes in a set. This one is from a jeweler that my parents got made for me for my birthday. And then this one is from the M Jewelers and it's a D. And then my neck, my bracelets are from Pura Vida, I love those. My earrings are from Argento Vivo. I Dyson air wrapped my hair today. Love it, a blowout look. And then my shoes are so fun. They're from Zara. I absolutely love them. They're just, I thought it'd be fun to do two different greens together. I don't know, we're trying it. And then my bag is from Bob Orr Collection. I tagged them on one of my recent Instagram posts, so it should be pretty easy to find them. But yeah, this is the fit. I love it. We're going to an Italian restaurant tonight because that's my dad's favorite and mine too, so I'm not upset. Packed a bag of stuff to go sleep at my dad's house tonight. We'll probably watch a movie after dinner, but yeah, that's what's up. Let's go see the father. And also, as for gifts, I was going to get him a golf shirt because he loves golf shirts. Um, however, he's very particular about how they fit on him. And so he asked, he said, hey, can we just go shopping for a gift instead? Um, and he can pick out some clothes. And I said, yeah, of course, that's way more fun. So we'll probably do that sometime this week or next week, but yeah. So I don't have a gift to give him today. I did bring him green juice earlier today, so. So as soon as you get to my dad's house, there's a lovely photo. <laughs> hey, I love it. Vinny, we're at dad's house, say hello. Happy Father's Day. What else do you have to say? Hi, girl. <laughs> All right, so I want to take a picture of my dad tonight, and his shirt just doesn't go with my dress. <laughs> We're gonna go to his closet and pick him out an outfit. <laughs> All right, bye bye. Welcome to my dad's room. He has the biggest closet ever, and I'm so jealous. Finley, <gasps> hello. <laughs> it's like we haven't seen each other. Let's pick dad out an outfit. All right, so he will wear this shirt with his jeans he's already wearing. Ta-da, <laughs> easy. We're on the couch, snuggled up, watching country music videos. We're watching Luke Combs right now, Forever After All. Great music video. To go. Nice outfit, Dad. Thank you. Freddie, let's see the fit. Got Fitted the today. Shoes Grandpa's shoes, Dad's Luke watch. Striped socks right there. Sheesh. Not Father's Day. <laughs> what is this? On a little walk before dinner. So my dad is great at dad jokes, and uh, I want him to share with you guys the one that he sent my family today. I ordered a chicken and an egg from Amazon today, and now we'll see which comes first. <laughs> the chicken or the egg? <laughs> I was so confused when I first saw it. Amazon is the only institution in the world that can figure out which, which comes first, the chicken or the egg. There you go. Hot tub time. The jet felt good for a little bit, but fast when they dumped it. All right, we are headed to bed. Just watch, just go with it. 
And I'll see you guys in the morning. I don't know whether to laugh or cry right now. <laughs> I'm having one of those Mondays where I just am so annoyed at everything. <laughs> I left my dad's house because Philly would have stopped barking and Freddie had to do something. Freddie like woke me up in a not relaxing way. Then I get here and I'm like still in my pajamas. I literally wrote in the car in my pajamas. And I try to get back in bed and my mom's boyfriend's here working and he's like on his work calls and Finley wouldn't stop working. So I brought Finley in here and then he wouldn't stop chewing things. Freddie came in here and needed help with something for his Apple Watch. I'm just complaining, I know. I hate starting my days like this and I hate feeling like this. I like being in good moods. I don't like being in bad moods because then everyone's like, Danielle, why are you in a bad mood? I can get bad moods sometimes. <laughs> and then I just heard a blender go off in the kitchen and I'm like, oh my God. Good thing is I have therapy in an hour. So good luck to my therapist. And then Brooke and I are recording Gals on the Go and those two things both put me in good mood. I also forgot to mention that I am the only girl this week in my house. My mom stayed in Illinois to be with her dad a little bit longer. And so it's me, my brother, my mom's boyfriend, and Finley, who is also a boy. And then my dad, obviously, and he's at his house, but he comes over here a lot. It was just like a lot of male energy. It's a lot of very not gentle energy. If you guys um, relate, um, please let me know. It's just like a lot. And I knew it was gonna be a lot going into this. I'm not complaining but I'm complaining. I love, I love some male energy, I do, and it's been fun, but there's just times like in the morning when I wanna have a relaxing morning and guys just don't do that in general. And to top it all off, Ryan and my friend Ethan are coming down to stay with us this week. And my mom will be back till Thursday. <laughs> so, lots of boys for me, Woo! All right, this is just getting funny. Um, I also didn't mention we have amazing guys out back working on our seawall because we had to get it redone, so that's been like an eight-day project. And to top it all off, I just heard the lawnmower, which means the landscapers are <laughs> all very good things, and we're very thankful to have those services, but I'm just laughing. The world does not want me to lay in this bed right now. Listening to motivation that my mom sent me. I just washed up my face. I have a gallon water bottle here. I'll link it down below. I got it off Amazon. We're gonna see if I actually finish this. Um, hopping on a therapy now. Hello. Oh. How are you? Good. Are you in your pajamas? Yes, it's been a whole morning. Oh, I love therapy. If you're thinking about going to therapy, trying it out, this is your sign. I just sometimes feel guilty calling up a friend or even talking to my family about what's going on in my life. Because I am just going through a big transition right now. And for me, therapy feels great. I know some of my other friends who go to therapy have said the same. It's just, you're paying them, so you, you just feel like you can say whatever you want. Unbuy, I don't know, it's just nice, and I'm really thankful for that. And now I'm like starving for lunch, but Finley's been so good. It's just beep, beep, beep. We're gonna go make some lunch. I think we have some leftover pasta, and that just is calling my name. Oh, I feel so much better. Brooke and I are recording in like 30 minutes, so I don't have a lot of time. I might just send it and stay in my PJs until I like literally have to get out of them. Just had lunch, it was delicious, making some progress. It's 12.30 and I'm almost at the 1 p.m. one, so I think that's that's a good thing, right? Guys, Freddie just got back and he got me a dinner shot. I think I did. Great Ooh, way to Freddy keep the day going. Aaron, little miracle shampoo. Oh, the lady talked me into it. I was just gonna buy some random stuff. And she she like, convinced you to buy yeah. that? It's deodorant. Yep. All right, ooh, you got the juices. Little ginger shots, so we gonna take them together? We are. Thanks, Freddie. This is like two ginger, maybe even three. It's fresh pressed ginger, lemon, and a dash of cayenne. All right, cheers to our health. Mm. Okay. <laughs> All right, ginger shot is in. Brooke's about to FaceTime me. 
and we are going to record our episode of gals on the go i love what we're talking about this week we are talking about acne insecurity all the things i'm like hey what's up hello <laughs> hey buddy hey 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 you guys what is up welcome back to gals on the go i am danielle I did, and then I was like, don't make it funny, Danielle, don't make it funny. One, yeah, that's a great point. One time I got a facial before, I think right before I went on Accutane. Just got this dope sweat set in from Cynthia Rowley. I'm obsessed with it. Um, it's this beautiful, just gray sweatsuit, and then it has studs on the sides, which are so cool. Also just got this package in from IMG. I placed an order going, I think I'm going to Miami next week with Delaney which will be really fun to reunite with her just a little girls weekend and um, I wanted some funky outfits so I'm working with my friend Elizabeth she's known as stylist check on Instagram and she was helping me pick out some fun outfits because I just like her style is my style but sometimes like other people see things on websites that you don't or just come up with outfit ideas that you might not this is a really fun set definitely like a dinner vibe um, these are the pants. A size medium in the pants. They're just these like black long pants. But then they like do a funky tie right here. I've seen them a lot right now all over. And then the top is just like a little halter top if I remember correctly. So it's just like a really fun set. I feel like it's super funky, super chic, super Miami with some heels, maybe even like a claw clip moment. Yeah, just did a little unboxing for you guys, I suppose. And then I still need to go to UPS and return my All Saints sneakers that I got because I need to exchange them with Revolve because the ones that came in, they're great, but they had like a little, it almost looked like a coffee stain. So I need to get that done. Maybe I'll do that today. So I decided to put on my swimsuit go outside, do this phone call, and get some vitamin D in, considering I really haven't been outside at all. Got the essentials, sun bum, sunscreen, this stuff is freaking amazing, it smells so good. Green juice that Freddie got me. Oh, it feels incredible out right now. Thank you for the sunshine, right Finn? Just got off the phone with Brooke, played fetch with Finley, brought him upstairs, he was getting hot and laid out for a little bit, responded to some more emails. Now we're gonna go inside. It's getting too hot. Guys, I'm making pretty good progress on my water bottle. Don't give up. Finley and I stay playing all day. <laughs> all right guys, just got dressed. I'm wearing my little Outdoor Voices exercise dress. This is the black one. Got this hat on from the capsule New York. I love it. Um, I just got this Daisy Marc Jacobs perfume. It smells divine. Thought I'd spray. Oh, that needs a third spray. <laughs> Putting in my go-to earrings, just these little gold hoop huggies. They just go well for casual um, attire and then also more fancy if you want, but I just like them because they add a little something to a casual outfit. My brother, my dad, and I are squatting up again tonight. <laughs> We're going to dinner at the marina. Um, it's just this little, like, restaurant on, like, the dock, basically. It's really, really good. Especially if you like seafood. I'm not a huge seafood person, but if I remember correctly, they have some good non-seafood lover options. But we're gonna go there and it'll be perfect. It'll be sunset time. My dad's coming from a workout, so it's super casual vibes, but I thought it'd be fun to get out of the house a little bit. All right, as for update, we're at 7 p.m., which means almost finished. What time is it? It's 6 at the 8. Oh my, I'm like right on track. I'm not even purposely trying to do this. <sighs> Again, I will link this water bottle down below. Freddie did just pick it up and spill a little bit. Final fit, wearing the platform Crocs. Don't text. You like my shoes? Yeah, bro. Wow, yeah. high top Crocs. Platform Crocs, bye Finley, see you in the middle. I really think a bug just flew up my nose, but I feel like I'd feel it, right? Usually you'll get like a sneezy feeling if you have tissue. Yeah, maybe I should blow my nose. He just like ran for me. And if you guys remember from when Delaney got a bug in her ear on the revolve trip, we don't need another repeat of that. So far, it's charged. No bug, we're good. I straight up just got a hot dog. So that's where we're at right now. Fish tacos, yum. Dinner was delicious. And now we're gonna walk down the marina just to, I don't know, I always like to walk after dinner. And 
see what's up. What's the happening? This is where the sailboat was that we went on. I think the sailboat's not here right now. All right, you guys, it's a new series we're starting here called Danielle opens packages with her dad and he yeah. makes funny faces apparently. Yeah. It was funny because, so I'm referring to in my, one of my week in my life vlogs, I got a pair of green shoes in the mail from Zara and I opened them in the car because we were leaving somewhere and I saw the package and I didn't even notice it while editing it, but my dad was like, <laughs> what are those? Because they're, you know, they're like green shoes. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> He feels bad. So I we're headed to we just dropped Freddie off after dinner. We're headed to the health food store and I'm gonna get some kombucha, maybe some ice cream. We'll just see what it what's all about. But I saw these packages and I thought it'd be fun to open them. Let's see what dad has to say. Alright, so this is from the Foxy Kind. They sent me a new set that they thought I would really like. Um, I like their clothes a lot like a chocolate brown set. So this is the top, it's a little long sleeve. Mm, very nice. <laughs> he approves, it ties in the front, very fun, very funky. And then, this is actually gonna be a bit warm for Florida, but flare brown pants, full fun vibes. And from my friend Tessa, she has Tessa Faye Studio. I modeled for her, if you will, um, for her clothing line, she was a fashion merchandising major with me at UGA and she was on more of the design route and she designs the most beautiful clothing and she said, hey, I wanna send you a surprise. So I have no idea what this is, but I'm excited. <gasps> is it a corset top? <gasps> oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. She, she is so talented, guys. Like she literally made this herself. <gasps> Oh my gosh, the Tessa Faye Studio, go follow her on Instagram. This is like, she picks out all the fabric, all the, and then you just tie it really tight in the back. And it's like a little little shirt. Oh. <laughs> I wonder if it's reversible. I it was like a corset or something. Well, it's called a corset top, oh, it but is. it's not like, oh, yeah, yeah, congrats, that was good. But it's so beautiful. Corset. Corset. corset, corset. I love this fabric. I made this custom corset with you in mind. It is reversible and should fit like a glove. I hope you love it. Go kill it in New York, Tessa. It's just so cool. Like I love that Like she went to UGA and she's pursuing her passion of designing clothing. And Gosh, Halo Top is good. Ben and Jerry's, Halo's. they have some good options. Got the goods, kombucha and ice cream. What a combo. Oh, thank you, gentlemen. Appreciate it. Wine glass out of the freezer, kombucha. Cheers. All right, I have to show you guys something very embarrassing. I've just been kind of on the go and just lazy when I wasn't on the go. Um, that I haven't unpacked like my products, my skincare products, my hair products from college. It's just all in bags and kind of all over my counter. And it's time that we organize my bathroom. And uh, I just, are you guys ready? Oh boy. <laughs> yep, and it keeps going. These are all my hair products and just random stuff I brought back from school. This is my everyday makeup bag, so I've just been using that. I have some of my major products here. I care this is just not okay. Like, thankfully, no one's been using my bathroom, but it's just not enjoyable for the getting ready experience. And in here, I have one of these things that I used to organize, but I put it away when I went off to college because this is used as a guest bathroom when I'm not here. So, but I'm gonna bring it back out. I'm gonna put my daily skincare products and just other things on this. Gonna watch Julian Hunter while I do this because they motivate me for life. All right, you guys, you saw the before. Are you ready for the after? <laughs> Ta-da! I'd say this looks a lot better. It's still got some stuff on it. But that's what bathroom counters are for. I got this amazing little spin organizer from Amazon. I'll link it down below. They also have it in clear and maybe some other colors, but 
I just have random stuff on the top, like I have my tweezers and my, you know, little hair roller. Got some oil, lip products, my toothbrush, toothpaste, um, random stuff. And then I have two perfumes here, daytime moisturizer, some hair oil, nighttime stuff, acne stuff. It's just great. It's got all kinds of nooks and crannies to organize. Tissues, and then I have my daily makeup bag. I always just, I don't ever unpack my makeup because I might bring it to a friend's house. I don't know. I just always like to have it in that. This is from Sephora Collection. I don't know if they sell it or not. It was when I was a part of the Troop SC, so I'm not sure. And then yeah, we've got paper towels, soap, <laughs> some body lotion. We killed it. I put all of my hair products and tools in there. You know, it's organized chaos. But yeah, my mom's gonna be really happy when she comes back and sees this. Okay, you guys, I don't know what it is, but there is something I love about cleaning, organizing, just doing things like that at night. I don't know why. My room will be messy all day. I just ignore it. I'm just whatever. And then at night, I get, I don't know if it's because I'm about to get in bed and I want it to be, you know, nice and clean, but I just love organizing at night. Like, I just organize my whole bathroom. Now I'm hanging up some stuff. I mean, these are new items that I just opened up in the car, but I'm so excited to style this little brown set here. I'm just organizing in my room right now because um, Ryan and Ethan come tomorrow. I just got off the phone with him. They're leaving at like 6 a.m. They're driving from Georgia. They're staying here for four or five days. It's kind of cool with driving. You can kind of just decide when you want to come and when you want to leave. And I'm just excited to be out in the sun. This is gonna be Ryan's last time. He's gonna be able to come here for a while. So I'm looking forward to that. And yeah. Thankfully though, their drive is still, you know, seven or eight hours. So if I wake up at a reasonable time tomorrow, I can get some stuff done in the morning. I have a long, long to-do list of just random stuff. Also, I am just about done. It says I did it, but there's still water underneath, so. I mean, it's 10.23, it says 9 p.m. You're supposed to be done, but whatever. I'm not usually like this, but I'm kind of in the mood to light this candle, and this candle is a Christmas candle. It's like a Fraser fur candle Freddie got me for Christmas. I feel like it'll just be very cozy and get me in a good mindset. All right, the word is that the lightning are killing it right now. Oh my gosh. Go Bolts, baby! Oh, that'd be so cool if we went to the Stanley Cup. Go oh, Bolts, Stanley, baby. Hello, Finley. Hi. My room is starting to smell like Christmas and I'm not mad about it. Okay, so I've got my planner here and usually I like to start my day by planning it, but every now and then I will do my doing well daily planner for the next day. Just so when I wake up, I kind of know, like I already have in my head what I have to do. I don't have to like make coffee, sit down and then plan out my day. I don't know if that makes sense. This is my planner. It's literally my planner. I designed it with doing well daily. I love it. There's one day on each page. It's always linked down below. Let's see what today's quote is. No risk, no magic. I love that. So I'm gonna trace the quote, write what I'm grateful for, some affirmations. It's just a good way, honestly, to end the day. And then I'm also gonna transfer anything from yesterday's to-do list. So work I um, refer to as YouTube. Side hustle is just anything else. Live to-dos is like grocery, stuff like that. And then this is by the hour. I love this page, this page is my life. And up until a couple months ago, you know, when I was a student, I would use work as school. So I'd put all my schoolwork here and then side hustle would be YouTube and podcast. It's actually so sad. Like I just went back to an old one of mine and like school works, like I admit, I, I, I'm never gonna see these again. Like all these things I had to do, like, oh my gosh, this is, All right, so I've come up with my to-do list for tonight as much as I can until I get sleepy and then tomorrow morning before my friends get here. I love listening to people talk about their to-do lists. I've been loving Julian Hunter's vlogs because Julian Hunter Havens, if you guys don't subscribe to them, I love them. Um, I met Julia on a trip to Germany we did with Sephora and I just, we became besties instantly. Like she's just the coolest person. And I just love how chill their vlogs are and they're very like, hey guys, this is what we're up to today. And so I really enjoyed it. So I wanted to kind of include you guys in on this. My brother just is constantly always just saying my name. So I'll kind of give you guys a rundown of my to-do list. So these are things I want to get done tonight and tomorrow. 
need to make a Squarespace account because we're working on a website for Gals on the Go, which will be fun so we can sell our merch on there. And like if we ever do live shows in the future, they're like just like a Gals on the Go website. I wanna do an Amazon fashion video. I found some amazing finds on Amazon. So I want to order those so I can, they can all come in in time so I can film a video and style them. Kind of like designer dupes, stuff like that. I need to submit today's podcast um, to our producer so he can edit it. I have a couple of pictures that I want to take for a couple of different companies that have gifted me stuff. If a company gifts me something and I'm obsessed with it, I want to style it and put it on my Instagram or something. So I have a couple of brands written down. I need to start editing this vlog. So that's all of my like YouTube podcasty stuff. I need to, um, my bank actually gave me a list of the payments that I had reoccurring with my old debit card, so I need to, it's gonna be a little tedious, but I need to go on each website and basically change my payment method to my new debit card. Um, I think I mentioned Delaney and I are going to Miami next weekend. I'm so excited to see her and things are booking up quickly. We really wanted to eat dinner at the Versace mansion. Gianni's, I believe is the restaurant. It's so good. I went there with Caitlin, if you guys remember that vlog and they're already full for dinner. All the nights were there. So I um, thought it'd be smart if we made some dinner reservations. So I need to start thinking about that. I have to do an exchange tomorrow that I didn't end up doing today. And then I also need to look at um, New York flights and a hotel for me, my mom. My dad actually might be coming too. I don't really know, um, but to our apartments. So that'll be my last time ever staying in a hotel in New York, which is so sad. I do love staying in hotels in New York, but just so we can't do a staycation. And I also need to look at um, flights as well because I'd rather book the flights sooner than later so they're not as expensive. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Just made myself a cup of sleepy time tea. We get the brand Celestial Seasonings. It has like a big bear on the front and we have the sleepy time extra tea. And it, I don't even take melatonin. This just relaxes me. So I'm gonna finish up my work, drink tea, get my PJs, get in bed. Got stress relief playlist on. About to hop in my bed and my PJs. Today started out rough, but you know, it ended great. I cleaned my room, I cleaned my bathroom. I'm gonna read, did some work. I'm feeling well rested and ready for tomorrow. And I'm so excited to see my boyfriend. So I'll see you guys in the morning. You guys, I just woke up and Freddie came in and he brought me a Starbucks breakfast sandwich. I'm so confused. This has to be a mistake. That's so nice. are from Lululemon. I have my Hoka sneakers on, Apple Watch, AirPods, not gonna ring my phone. Just gonna go for a little walk. Just got back from my hot girl walk. <laughs> it is so hot outside and I even went in the morning so it wouldn't be as hot. I brought Finley for a little bit and then I brought him back and then I kept walking. So, Ooh, that was a good way to start the day though. I, just, I feel like, I don't, I don't feel angsty or anything. I just feel like I walked it out. Got my little working buddy today. <laughs> He's a good boy. Well, that is a wrap for today's vlog. I'm just gonna go to the post office and do my exchange and just get some computer work done and get ready for the boys to get here. They're on the road right now. They are supposed to get here around three or four, so I'm so excited. I think when they get here, we're just gonna go to the beach um, and chill out or maybe we'll just hang out back and we're making dinner tonight. So yeah, be a good time. So much for watching and I'll see you guys very soon for next video. Bye.